Hey guys, what's up? It's Apple Critics from AppleCritics.ca, and in this video, I'll be showing you how to update and install iOS 7 on your iDevice. Now, this following tutorial works for the iPhone 4, the iPhone 4S, the iPhone 5, and the iPod Touch 5G, and all the iPads will also be compatible with this tutorial. Now, all you have to do is is go to the first link in the description and from there it will tell you uh, a written tutorial and it will give you all the download links you need. And the only download link you need uh, is iOS 7 for your respective device uh, and the latest iTunes. Once you have done that, you can continue to the next step. Now, what you're going to do now is just connect your iPhone or iPod or even iPad to iTunes. Now, once your device is connected, what you're going to do is go into iTunes. Now what you're going to do is if you're on Windows, you're going to press uh, on Shift and then Update. Or if you're on Mac, what you're going to do is press on Option and then Update. Now what you're going to do is hit Option if you're on Mac or Shift if you're on Windows. And then go to Check for Update. And then you're going to find the firmware that you downloaded and I put it on my desktop. Then you're going to hit Open. Now, as you can see right there, it detected the firmware, then all you have to do is hit update. And now, it will extract the software. So, as you can see, it's extracting the firmware and it's almost done. And now, it's verifying the iPhone update with Apple. It's loading up the update now. And now it has a progress bar. And now it's rebooting. And you should get this notice on iTunes that it's almost finished. And you should feel a vibration. And there you go. That is iOS 7. So thanks for watching this video on how to get iOS 7. Please be sure to subscribe to like this video. Please follow me on Twitter at twitter.com slash applecritics. Also go ahead and like this video as I know you watch. Also go ahead and iMessage me for any questions on this at applecriticsyt at me.com. And go ahead and check out applecritics.ca for the latest Apple news reviews and more. And thanks for watching.